Hey, welcome back. In this video, I want to show you a very cool way to do live translations of what you're saying for your classroom. To do that, what we're going to do is we're going to have a PowerPoint running and it can just be a blank slide in PowerPoint. And we're going to use that in combination with your projector in order to show live translations of what you're saying in, let's say, Spanish. So the first thing is you would connect yourself to your projector like you normally would. And in this case, I'm just talking about the duplicate mode where whatever you're seeing on your screen is what's showing on the projector. The next thing you need to do is just open up PowerPoint. It should be on your computer. If you go down here to the search and type in power, you should see it pop up. Click on that, click on blank presentation. Once that blank presentation opens up, I typically will get rid of these boxes here. I don't need those. I can just click on them and delete them. And then what I want to do is I want to go up here to slideshow and I want to make sure that this is checked. Always use subtitles. Then go over here to subtitle settings. I click that for this example. What we're going to do is translate my English into Spanish. So I want to make sure that spoken language is set to English. Then subtitle language is set to Spanish. And there's a list of languages here to choose from. Next, we're going to choose where the translation will appear on the screen. And I'm going to pick above the slide. Okay, switch views now so that you can see the actual computer. And I'm going to use this screen over here to represent my projector. It's basically acting the same way. It's plugged into the computer. And you can see whatever's on the projector screen here is also going to be on my computer. So all you have to do now is you're going to hit present. When you hit present, it automatically will put the presentation over here. And it says listening down here. This is on the projector. And you can see what I'm saying pops up at the top of the screen. So you're going to be able to see that what I'm saying right now is being translated right into Spanish. And this is actually on the projection that you're using in the room. So you can keep this running as you're teaching your lessons and the students that need this translation will be able to see it clearly back on my actual computer screen. This is the speaker note view. So what I can do is reduce this over here. And you notice that I'm still getting the live translations over here on my projected screen. And here then I could just navigate wherever I need to. And let's say I needed to show something that was on this slideshow right here. And what I could do then is I can drag this one over onto my projected screen and then I can resize it. And now I'm able to teach off of this screen right here or whatever else I need to do by just dragging these windows over to this teaching screen. So I have this whole space here. And at the top, I still have the translations going live. So throughout my entire class, I can use this method to have the PowerPoint running with the live translations. And all I need to do is be able to drag the screen from my laptop over to the projected screen. Now, if I wanted to close out of this, I could simply just reduce these. I could go back over here. I can go back down to my PowerPoint presentation, and I can end the slideshow. And once I end the slideshow, you can see I go right back to being in duplicate mode, which is what I started with.